Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com. I'm here to give a quick overview on how to play our math vocabulary game, Codebreaker Math. When you first start the game, this is the menu you'll see. Let's go ahead and click Start. Here's the written instructions, but I'm going to go ahead and skip those since I'll be going over how to play. The uh, Here's the uh, game board, and what you're given is a series of symbols that you need to break. And there's a hint up here. So this will be the math definition to this word up here. You can use, in case you're stuck, you can always hit the hint button, and I'll show you how that works in a minute, but let's go ahead and try to figure out what this is. The uh, So I know this word here is one character, so I suspect that's an A, and yeah, I'll go ahead and drop it there. And I'm not sure, but I know that a dozen is 12. So let's look through here. This looks like right length. And if you notice, 12 would be T, W, E, and it also ends in E. So I suspect this is a 12. So let's go ahead and T up there. And if you notice, I'll put the C up here, you'll see that it fills, it highlights the other symbols where it goes grab the L and what I'm doing is I'm clicking with the mouse and dragging so I'm not exactly sure what this is let's go ahead and click hint and so I think this might be group see and if I didn't have an idea what it was I could always hit the help hint button but I like a little challenge so set that's gonna be a group or set of 12 okay that makes sense thing matches up let's go ahead and hit submit and see the go ahead and close that out see the next let's go ahead and play again we get the next math vocabulary word and it's face and uh, what I like to do is I figure that is an A and you'll see that it filled in other locations so I'm not really sure uh, what this is but I know that okay a surface it can be a flat surface okay that's but let's say I didn't know that I can keep, keep hitting hint until I got an idea of what it is. So now I'm sure it is a flat surface. So let's go ahead and click flat. And now as I fill it, fill it in, I see that figure is starting to show up here. I can figure that one out from knowing the definition. And let's go ahead. Flat surface of a flat surface of a three what type of figure is it dimensional and if I didn't know I can go ahead and what sure if, if I wasn't sure of the spelling do that and submit and I succeeded and let's play again now one thing I forgot to show you is that let's go ahead and just fill in anything here if I do submit before I've completed the entire, before I've broken the entire code, and, and it'll tell me that I've not completed the whole text. So that's how you play Code Breaker Math. Um, I hope you enjoy playing it. I uh, hope the video helped a little bit, and thanks for watching.